I'm Sister Simone Campbell. I'm a Sister of Social Service. When do I feel most connected to God? Hmm. Well, I, I think for me, there are those lovely, gifted moments of total awareness of God. I mean, those lovely prayer moments usually comes after some kind of struggle where, where there's a great gift of peace. But I think mostly I'm aware of God. Looking back, I can see great moments of gift in my life. Um, in healthcare reform, I had the great opportunity of doing a, a piece that made change happen. I wrote the what's called the nun's letter that made a big difference for a lot of people on on um, uh, in the Congress to vote for the health bill and I was really keenly aware during that whole process of really go walking willing which for me is the spirit's presence and that was a very profound thing ordinary everyday life uh, I I walk faithfully and have some awareness of God, obviously, but it's not that huge sense of presence and connection. That's Those are rare gifts that nourish along the way. And then something that would surprise people about me, well, nuns are, nuns are usually mysteries to people anyway, and just that we're ordinary human beings surprises folks. I think as a Catholic, though, something that has surprised uh, many people is that it's not we're not a monolithic organization where we just um, take direction from the bishops that I disagree with bishops on a regular basis and get into a little bit of trouble with them. But, but mostly it's, it's all of us trying to live faithfully the gospel and the gospel message. And so there's great divergence among us. And then I'm fairly progressive uh, politically, and, um, but I find it totally consistent with my faith. And often nowadays much of the Catholic Church, well I think with our politics, gets identified with the conservatives of Santorum and Gingrich and it's not the faith I know. So it could be surprising that a seriously progressive person who identifies more as Democrat than anything else would could be a Catholic sister and do this life and live it moderately faithfully and do the best we can. I guess that could be a surprise.